What's up guys, Sal here. So it's no secret at this point that Samsung is ending the Galaxy Note line in favor of the Galaxy Z Fold line. We have strong data to back this up that they are transitioning the Note line into the foldables since the latter is a much more profitable venture and has huge growth potential. So the question is not about whether or not they are discontinuing the Note line, but rather are we gonna see one last Galaxy Note next year. For the past few weeks, reports on this topic have been flip-flopping quite a lot. First, multiple big tipsters said there is no development of the Galaxy Note 21 so far and reveal Samsung's flagship roadmap for 2021 that has no mention of the Galaxy Note 21. A few days later, we got a report from a big South Korean website citing industry insiders that the Galaxy Note 21 is indeed happening, albeit Samsung will launch only one model instead of two like they've been doing for a couple of years. They are apparently doing it to reduce the market share of the Galaxy Note in favor of the Z Fold 3. Now, the shocker came a couple of days ago when Reuters reported that Samsung has no plans to launch the Galaxy Note 21 next year. Now, as you know, Reuters is a huge reputable website and they have big sources in almost the whole tech industry. They confirmed this news not with one source but three of them telling the exact same thing that Samsung does not have plans to launch a new version of the Galaxy Note for 2021. Since Reuters is a big and reputable name and when they say there won't be a note going forward, there's certainly a lot of credence to it. But before you get disappointed, let me tell you the Galaxy Note 21 isn't dead yet. From the time Reuters reported this thing a couple of days ago, we've got three more sources saying the development of the Galaxy Note 21 has officially begun. First up, a Korean tech forum mentioned that the Note 21 was confirmed in one of the new display tests that Samsung is preparing. It mentions that Samsung is doing tests for two display samples, punch hole camera and the under display camera. However, it also mentions that since the under display camera technology is still very expensive with low yield rates, the Galaxy Note 21 most probably won't adopt this technology. The other two sources are these two Twitter leakers. Their sources also say the Note 21 is indeed in the early stages of development. Ross Young, a renowned name, also said we may see the Note 21 next year. So this suggests the Note 21 is still alive in the early development phase, but that doesn't guarantee though that we'll surely see it getting launched next year. Because a lot of the times companies develop products but don't end up releasing them. For example, the OnePlus 8T Pro, we heard rumors and leaks about it but OnePlus never launched it. So it's possible the same might also happen with the Galaxy Note 21. I guess Samsung is playing safe. I mean, just to be safe, they're developing the handset for now. And depending upon the market condition, the way people perceive the S21 Ultra with the S Pen, they'll decide whether or not to actually go into the next stages of the development of the Note 21 in the first half of 2021. But for now, it certainly looks like the Galaxy Note 21 is still alive. But whether or not that translates into an actual product is remain to be seen. I guess we'll probably know for sure at the unpacked event on January the 14th. Let me know what you think about this down in the comments. And as always, I'll see you tomorrow. Peace out.